this is Charles from the Chainzilla team. Today we're checking out the pre-release of the Chameleon Mobile Wallet and we're very excited about this release. It's the first pre-release of the, uh, imp we want to call it the evolution of Agama because we took the core technology of Agama and built it from the ground up in a, a better interface to make it more user friendly. And um, if you have any feedback about the interface, about the wallet, please reach out to us. We rely on your feedback to improve the wallet and when you get to test it, we will be making sure that we're taking into account all of the feedback from the users. Currently what we're doing is we're restoring the wallet and once we restore it, we'll add a few coins and make a transaction in order to walk you through the basic functions of the wallet. You'll notice that we've reduced the seed length to 12 word seed in order to make it more user friendly. And what the uh, wallet is doing now is asking us for a password to encrypt the wallet because it stores the seed in your device in order to make it more accessible so you don't have to input your seed every time you log in. On the dashboard, uh, you'll get the add coin option and we're going to add the Komodo coin. And since this is Electrum based, you'll notice that it will take a moment for the coin to be added and the information to be fetched. Let's go ahead and add another coin. And when you select the next coin, you'll see the rotate um, graphic on the top. Uh, it will show you the balance of your your USD balance, which will actually add other, other um, fiat currencies as we go. But currently it's only in USD. And it will show you the balance of uh, your coin and any, any market changes that are fetched from the coin market cap uh, API. We're going to add a few more coins just so you get a full view of what the pie chart looks like and then we'll make a transaction. And to make a transaction it's quite quite easy. Uh, you see the plus button. The plus button gives you the send or receive. It will also give you other options as we advance the wallet. So we're going to select send and you will get the send screen here. You will paste the address of the coin you're trying to transfer and in this case it will be Qtum. Once you click send it will go into a different screen that will show you um, the amount, the transaction fee and it will ask you for your wallet password. Um, currently the transaction fee in this screen is showing incorrect but once we get to this screen it shows the correct fee so as you can see it's still like I said in pre-release uh, but the wallet is functional and now we can go back to our normal screen to our home screen and select another coin and this is basically it this is uh, the basic functionality of your wallet which is in order to receive and send uh, transactions I hope you guys enjoyed the demo. Please leave any feedback, reach out to us on our social media, and keep an eye on our ICO that's launching on February 1st in 2019.